to offer a comment. No one has notes. What would yours be? Now that you mention it, I believe your film needs another layer. Hmm. The real horizon. The real us. Right. The verite. The truth. The grit. Not just the gloss. Exactly. And we can get you inside. What do you have in mind? Candid gorilla unit? A Blair Witch counterpoint to your blue sky, home away from home message. All we need is a camera. And some film. Super 8 be okay? Good. Action! You trying to ruin my scene? Or you just want to touch me? You don't get out of my face and I really will touch you. God, you're real trailer trash, aren't you? I kind of like that. Only pigs like trash. Well, FYI, each of us is making like 2K a week for portraying new furs in this bogus movie. And the best part is, we get to walk away from here. And I, for one, have a guest spot on a TV sitcom next week. Have a nice life. Two grand a week for playing troubled teens. And to think we do it all day for free. They don't look troubled to me. Of course not. Who'd want to send their screwed up kids to a school full of screw ups? This, dearly beloved, is why we're not in the movie. They're afraid we'd play ourselves. We'll be needing you at the lodge. You know, I do have other duties. Well, I understood that you were at our disposal. Your disposal? Well, call it what you will, but I had to let you in the shop. No, thank you. Camera shy, aren't we? We do have a hair and makeup person that could... <sighs> For the record yeah you look way better than any of them <laughs> thanks augusto what are you doing capturing the real you the real me doesn't appreciate having your picture taken without her permission then show us that rage that Boiling anger, heaving and churning inside. You mean like this? Elaine, you're referring to your stepmother? Yeah. What was she like when you first met her? She was uh, trying to get on my good side. She knew how important I was to my dad back then. So she was friendly at first? How did she show that? She was all smiles and stuff. And what kind of stuff? Like touching me. Touching you where? Like, uh... Like on my, my hand. You know, she just found a, a way to touch me. And you told her to stop? Uh, no. No, not really. It's okay, Scott. Take your time. She was my stepmother, but she didn't like it. It? It, uh... Being a mother... See, she's only like 10 years older than me. And now she's got to play being a mom. She wasn't into it, fine, whatever. You know, she wasn't going to be my mom anyways. And you made this known to her? She, uh, she got the message, yeah. How'd she respond? She started hitting on me. Hitting? Yeah, hitting. You know, like, for sex. When was the first time? I don't know. Um, about six, maybe eight months ago. She looked at me uh, by the pool as I walked by. But different, you know, like like looking me over. So she was trying to seduce you? Yeah, I guess you could say that. How'd you feel about it? I was upset. At her? At both of them. My dad left my, my mom for her, and now he was going to leave me alone with her. So you were angry at both of them? Yeah. She broke up my family, you know? like if she never showed up then we'd all still be together I hated that I, I, 
want some payback. Then there was actual sexual contact between you and her? Yeah. How many times? I don't know. Uh, a lot. How many times is a lot? I didn't count, okay? It was a lot. Did she ever write to you? Write to me? She lived in the same house. Did you record any of your sexual encounters? What do you mean that I, I record? Photos, videotapes. Why? No. Did you tell anyone else what was happening? No. Why are you asking me these kinds of questions? Documented proof. It, it, it would help your case. No. The answer is no. She just went after me. I wanted to tell my dad. I did. I, I, I couldn't, though. I, uh... Uh, what's the word? I, I betrayed him. And that was, that was the worst of it. What I did to him in my heart. And she just kept after me. You're a teenager, Scott. A minor. She had no right to seduce you. Yeah, but I'm a guy and I should have stopped her. <laughs> Scott, women are not the only victims of sexual abuse. It could happen to boys and men as well. So what happens now? The wheels are already in motion. Mrs. Berenger, Child Protective Services. Come on in. Thank you. to know when why how he, wa he wanted to know how just it made me feel like it's over Scott. it made me feel like it's over it's not over until i get back at her it's not over until she pays she's gonna be sorry wait until she So what's up with him? I don't know, and I don't care. How about you? Are you okay? Totally. Why? Well, Scott being your ex and all, and he's speaking to Shelby and not you. The operative word being ex. I'm gonna kill that jerk. If we fall, he's gonna kill us for ruining his little movie. Look at those two. Visually, they are a great pair. Yeah. I mean, really. The skin, the hair, the eyes. But these two should be on the cover. Got it, Clay. I'm there. Move it faster, guys. Faster. Let's go. Oh. Okay, that's it. I'm gonna get up there. Kick Stay him. focused, so. I'm gonna focus the toe of my boot. Ah! Stay calm, so get a foothold. Are you okay? Yeah, I'm okay. I'm okay. This one is my favorite. I want you to use this one right here. This one. Nice work, man. That stunt was spectacular. For a minute there, I actually thought you were falling, and I went, woo, but it was good. <laughs> oh. Oh. You happy now? 
I think I 